Hey what's going on guys Tanmay of our simple snippets and welcome back to a new video tutorial under network security or information security and in this video tutorial we're going to be taking a look at one of the algorithm modes that is electronic code book or ECB so in the previous video tutorial of this network security information security playlist we discussed different types of algorithm modes and algorithm types and i said that i'll be covering individual algorithm modes separately so this is the very first algorithm mode that is electronic code book which is kind of the most simplest one out of the five different modes that we are going to be discussing in further video tutorials so with that being said let's start off with a little bit of theory and then i'll explain to you the working of electronic code book so starting off with a little bit of theory as i mentioned this is the simplest mode of operation and what happens is the plain text message is divided into blocks of 64 bits so this can be more than 64 but usually it is 64 bits then each such block is encrypted independently of the other blocks so let's say your plain text is more than 64 bits okay so it's like 128 bits so what happens is there will be two blocks 64 block each and each block will be encrypted separately or independently and for all blocks same key is going to be used for encryption as well as decryption also if a plain text block repeats in the original text the corresponding cipher text block will also repeat in the encrypted message so let's say you have a b c and let's say now we are encrypting only three alphabets at a time so this is one block then we have b x y let's say this is another block and let's say again a b c repeats so this is the third block what this line or what this point is saying is the encrypted text or the cipher text of this block let's say it is p x y let's say this block is l m n and since a b c and a b c is repeated the encrypted cipher text of this block is also going to be p x y okay so this is what this point is stating us over here and lastly it is suitable only for small messages and it is not really very secure compared to other encryption modes so we'll see that in further videos and as you can see this operates on block ciphers so this electronic code book and in fact all the other algorithm modes operate on blocks of code and not stream ciphers we've discussed about block cipher and stream cipher in previous video so now let's actually see how the working goes with the diagrammatic explanation okay so as you can see on the screen i have the proper encryption technique or encryption working of how the ecb or electronic code book works so let's say we have n blocks of plain text okay so you can see step number 1 step number 2 and step number n so n means after n iterations or n rounds so depending upon how long your plain text is let's say your plain text is around 128 bits and if you are dividing it in 64 bit blocks then the number of blocks would be 2 right similarly if the plain text is very long we probably would require more than two blocks right depending upon how how much we are dividing each block for so for step number 1 what is happening is we are taking the plain text we are taking the encryption key we are encrypting it and we are getting the cipher text so this is the first block similarly this is happening to step number 2 so this is the second block let's say our again our code is abc xyz lmn something like that so this is the first block we are applying encryption to it and we are getting the cipher text this is the second block so this is step number 2 we are getting the cipher text and then after n steps so let's say there are like 100 steps in between so there are 100 more blocks and then we are getting at the last block so the same thing is happening at the last block also so the plain text block n we are taking we are taking the same key you can see that the same key is used over here we are performing encryption and we are getting the cipher text block n so this is the very basic working of electronic code book algorithm mode and if you are wondering how the decryption happens it is exactly the reverse process of this encryption process so if i just change the arrows in this direction using the same key the encryption can be possible provided that the algorithm is a symmetric key algorithm wherein the same key is used for encryption and decryption otherwise another key would be used so in decryption the same cipher text block is taken and then the key is used to decrypt to get the plain text back So step number one would be take the cipher text block one, use the key to perform decryption and get the plain text block one. Then reiterate this entire process n times to get all the plain text back in a proper sequence. Okay. So this was the complete working of electronic code book, and this is the most simplest algorithm mode as I've mentioned earlier. And as you can see from the diagram itself, it looks pretty simple. We are just splitting the entire plain text into some designated block sizes. we using the same key to encrypt those blocks and we are getting the cipher text block 
and similar thing is happening in the reverse process of decryption so yeah that's it for this video guys i hope you understood electronic code book algorithm mode how it works how it works on block ciphers and that's it for this video guys if you like this video please give it a thumbs up share it with your friends if you haven't yet subscribed make sure you subscribe to this channel so that you get notified whenever i upload a new video tutorial on network security or any other technology oriented topic thanks for watching guys i'll see you guys in the next video tutorial peace